some lessons we have to learn for ourselves and hope that we don't learn them too late. The rich man in today's passage doesn't have a name so that each of us can put ourselves in his place to hopefully learn his lesson in this life and not in the life to come. The rich man wants relief in the afterlife, having lived in a way that showed disdain for those less fortunate than himself. When relief for himself doesn't come, he begs to have relief preemptively sent to his family so that they don't repeat his mistakes. The response he gets is that if they won't listen to Moses and the prophets, they won't listen when someone rises from the dead either. The irony of that statement for us is that from John's Gospel, we know that the poor man shares at least a name with the person who did rise from the dead. And we know that the man telling the parable rose from the dead as well. And yet we still don't heed the lesson, the lesson of care and concern for the poor, of giving from one's abundance to fulfill the needs of others, and acting with compassion, concern, and empathy. This is a lesson that stretches back to Moses and the prophets, and really back to Abraham himself. And yet we still fail to use our money in God-honoring, faith-affirming ways. May we learn the lesson of the rich man for ourselves before it's too late.